Welcome back to The Cutting Board. Today we're here with Yemi Sagastume. Now, I met Yemi the first time while we were working together at a clinic in the Amazon in Brazil. So this is my first opportunity to meet her. She was working as a nutritionist at this clinic as a volunteer from Guatemala. Yeah. And we had this opportunity to learn so much and I learned a lot from Yemi about nutrition. And today she's gonna to be presenting us with a recipe that makes zucchini rolls. What are we gonna to do today? Yeah, zucchini rolls. Well, many people don't like zucchini, you know, but I'm gonna give you some reasons. One of them is that it lowers cholesterol. So if you have high cholesterol, this will be a nice way to keep it low. It also protect our heart. So, and it's super easy. First, we're gonna make a paste with some cashews. These cashews are soaked overnight because then they are softer and it's creamier, you know? So we're gonna put that on a blender first. And the things that we're gonna need is some cucumber, carrots, and celery. These are gonna be chopped in little like sticks. Cilantro. I mean, yeah, cilantro, sorry. And avocado. And so it's just like little regular rolls. Instead of using rice, we're gonna use the zucchini to make the, the rolls. So basically, we've got a raw dish here that yes, is going to be super healthy with a lot of flavor in it. Yes, and the reason why it's raw is because, you know, we can keep all the nutrients and pack with vitamins and, and minerals in there. So the first thing we have to do is put the uh, cashews in the blender and we're going to add also then lemon. lemon, yes. So, so how much cashews do we have this here? This is one cup. This is for like 10 servings or more than that because we, we, we want to put a lot of um, paste on the bottom so it tastes good because everything is like plain savor, flavor, I mean. And so we're gonna put some lemon on that. How much? Just, uh, just squish a little bit, it's, it doesn't matter. I think it depends on how sour the people want it because okay. every, everybody's different, you know? So we just add some of that. And we're also gonna need some, uh, this is garlic powder. So we're gonna put a little bit of that too. How are we yep. doing here? Yeah, it's good. It's good? <laughs> and a little bit of All salt, right. just a little bit. It's not that much, it's just because already the cashews have very nice flavor. And so we don't need to add extra stuff. Yeah, that's perfect. Right. And if you want it creamier, you can add a little bit of water just for, so it to be a little more um, watery type of consistency. So that's good. So then we're gonna just process it. All right. So now we have our cashew paste mm -hmm. ready. It's already so tasty in there, you should try. It's already so tasty. <laughs> yes, it's very tasty. And then we're gonna just um, use the zucchini. So we're gonna make our little layers of, very thin layers of zucchini. So the first thing we have to do is cut the ends of the zucchini. And the trick here is like peel some of the, of the skin until you come into a nice size. We're gonna put this away a little and we're gonna just grab it and see this is like not enough to make a roll so we have so to keep going maybe the second one okay this is better so very thin very thin I guess like you just be careful with your fingers but you see like that's what we're gonna use so I already have some in here ready prepared and okay. this is very easy to, ens to assemble so maybe we're gonna use some of this, it's good. Put this here back. All right, so the first thing we have to do is in one end of the zucchini, we're gonna put some of the paste. So you're being generous with the paste. Yeah, I mean, if you put a lot, it's gonna be hard to roll. So mm -hmm. it, it depends on how much veggies you wanna put inside. So I put the, 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 the paste and then you put some, I have some cucumber, like I said, so you arrange the cucumbers and then carrots. And then I have avocado in here, so let me cut it. So this is very easy. Takes so we have flavor from the actual paste mm -hmm. that we made that's giving us our creaminess. Yes. And then the veggies inside are giving body to the dish, but also flavor. Exactly. And then and on a, another secret for this recipe is that you have to arrange things like all the way to like give the, I don't know how to say it, but <laughs> because you're gonna roll it. So you need the, 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 the vegetables to be a little 
on even one in the, end. Even in the, yeah, in the, in the bottom. Nice and even on one yeah, end. Yeah, exactly. So then you put the, the I keep saying celery, you know? Cilantro. cilantro. <laughs> okay, so I just, the, the last thing is to put the cilantro because otherwise it's going to be hard to roll. The, okay, so you see this, just the rolling thing. And then we have it. That's the first one. So maybe you can try to make one. <laughs> All right. I mean, it's very easy. I let's mean, kids can do it at home. Let's see how and it's going to work. I, for me, I like to have this recipe for dinner because it's very um, light, but it's also full of nutrients. You know, you have the protein from the cashews. We have minerals and vitamins. Vitamin C from, from um, the zucchini. So it's good for our immune system to have this, all this... Uh, you know, no trends. It does not help. It does not hurt that it looks good because we eat with our eyes. Yeah. So having that really vibrant color makes it that much more appetizing. Did I put too much? No, in that's here? good. I no. didn't. Our oh, cilantro. Yeah. So. I, if people don't like cilantro, well, they can, they can omit it, you know. But I think it gives like that that flavor, like fresh flavor from the cilantro. It's gonna be yeah. That's a good job. All right. Let's see if I can get mine to stand up too. Let's yeah, see, there we go. That's it. All right. So that's the recipe. And like I said, it's very simple, very easy to make. And I think you're going to start loving zucchinis because the flavor is very plain on the zucchini. So when you add all these other elements, it's just going to be like a party in your mouth. So I've got this dish that's delicious. It's raw. Mm -hmm. It's vegan. And it's going to help me lower my cholesterol. And I want to eat one of these okay, right now. Try. Let's go ahead Let's and try see. these. Mm. It delivers on every single level that we're looking for. Join us again on the cutting board for more delicious recipes like this.